DK family, we're currently booking our flights to Bangkok. We're spending some money. Hopefully everything goes to plan and we don't take it L. So we're going to keep you updated. Welcome to DK Adventures. For the past three weeks, we've been planning our trip to Thailand and they require so many documents to get into there. So it was all confusing at first, but we spent about a week researching before applying for the COE. And that got denied about six times because we were doing it wrong. This is the reality for me. To get your COE approved, you will need to have a confirmation from your ASQ hotel stay. And to decide which ASQ hotel we were gonna stay at was a hard decision considering how expensive they are for the average person. But after extensive research, we decided to stay with Graceland, Bangkok. I also spent hours on the phone to our insurance company just to find out that our insurance wasn't even valid and that we needed to purchase a new one. Bro. What the hell? <laughs> DK family, we're getting this vaccine. Gaudi's getting the jab now, so when we go to Thailand, she's all protected. I don't like vaccines, guys. <laughs> you nervous? Yes. The last time I got jab was like, oh my god, probably like five years ago. Come. No, okay. okay. No. Come, come, come. Okay. If you don't work, I'm gonna cry. Why am I crying? I don't like needles. Uh, you'll be okay. I love them. Oh, they're beautiful. They're beautiful. <laughs> they're beautiful. We're my best friends. Oh my oh good. Oh good. Oh good. There we go. Three, two, one, and we're finished. That's it. Just think about the hot weather in Thailand that you're going to be experiencing. DK family, we just got approved Woo! to enter Thailand. <laughs> Guys, after Woo! so much, like, and so many declines, we made it. We did it, me and you. Nobody else, me and we you. We did it! Oh my goodness. Guys, we're going to Thailand. And we got our confirmation from the ASQ hotel. We got everything. I can't wait to go into Thailand. So guys, we just got emailed by Singapore Airlines saying that they're changing our flight a whole 24 hours later to the 30th, right? Which means 33 hours in Singapore. It's the day before we start traveling, so we need to get our PCR test. Let's go. Yeah. Sorry? Tampon, yeah. Okay. It comes with the paper, right? Yes, yes. We're flying tomorrow, so would it be avail like would we get the results tonight? Yes. Okay. So guys, they're just scanning our documents quickly, then we're gonna go to your PCR test. Be careful. <laughs> you cry a little bit. It's gonna be okay, babe. Okay. You're strong, man. Ah! Woo! So two PCR tests cost us 17,000 lek. We're negative, we're negative. We're negative. Guys, as soon as I was like walking up, my lab was feeling so nervous. I was like, shit, like, what if we did all of this and, doof, doof. and it comes out positive? Doof, doof. And when I heard a girl say negative, I was like, yes, yes. Albanian accent has never sounded so baby, sweet. Baby, come on. Negative. Proud of you, baby. I'm proud of you. Thank you for your safe. Thank you. Goodbye, Goodbye Tirana Terrace Apartments. We're going to uh, miss Tirana and his apartment. It's been amazing. Thank you, Alma. Thank you, everybody. Raining. Appreciate it. Have yeah, a good day. Have a bit, yeah? Middle Pafsham. Fed him and dirty. Where's the big one? Your head mask? You're so kind. Drive safe. Stay safe. Okay. Have a good day.
God bless. Bye bye. Where are you from? Um, to Turkey, Istanbul. Istanbul. Have a nice night. Thank you. So we made it into the airplane. They took my little suitcase away because they said they're trying to minimize contact because of the pandemic. Yeah, I saw the people come in with suitcases, which is what I was a bit disappointed about. I believe Air Albania and Turkish Airlines are like one out here because yeah. we booked with Turkish Airlines, but we're fine with Air Albania. So maybe we're on the wrong flight. No, no, this is going to Istanbul. Are you sure? Yes. Are you scaring me? Stop. <laughs> I'm already annoyed they took my suitcase away because I forgot certain things in there. And I won't see our suitcase and my suitcase until so we... Singapore. They gave us these cool little hygiene sets. It I comes like with a mask and... And butter. antiseptic wipes. Nice. I like how everyone's adjusting to the pandemic. And this plane is actually packed. Like, I don't think there's one seat that's not filled. There's a lot of space, actually, for just being like economy. There's a lot of leg room. A lot of leg room. <laughs> I love that. So they gave us a little bag filled with snacks and along with those snacks comes a little sandwich then there is a juice a cherry flavored drink and they also put in a little sweet for us which is super cute That was a good flight. That was a really good flight. Really quick. We even arrived 20 minutes earlier than we were meant to. Exactly. I listened to some music, recorded some videos. <laughs> Watched Simple. some movies. Istanbul International Airport is so big. And like, this isn't even the full airport. Yeah, last time we were here, it was like, it looked completely different. And I thought like, that's where we're going back to. You thought we were at the wrong airport. <laughs> okay. Is this really Istanbul? Uh, this is trans transfer desk. Alright guys, we just talked to the guy at the transfer desk and he said that all our documents are in order. We just need to go to the check-in desk for Singapore Airlines. Show them our little receipts for our luggage. And our COE, our COE and stuff like that. The DK family just went through security. I'm telling you, a British passport is going to get me in so much trouble. Like he looked at my passport and he just shook his head and he, was, he has a really funny like a personality. But he just shook his head and then he started asking me for all these other documents whereas Gaudi, Swiss passport, she went straight through, no problem, so. And now we're out, but we need to find a way to come back in. Yeah. And I don't know how to do any of it, so I'm just going crazy right now. Yeah, we don't, we don't know where we are, what to do, so we're going to keep you guys up to date. Istanbul's duty free and airport is just so beautiful. I wonder how the hell we get to the check-in area. <laughs> oh, we're crazy. Bro, where is check-in? I don't see no signs for check-in at all. Know how to get to the check in. Check in? Yes. yes. Where are we going? Here? Singapore Airlines. On the right side, exit. Okay. Customs upstairs. upstairs. Thank you so much. So he said straight. Really Peter, I need to pee as well. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's crazy. So we gotta follow the alphabet and go all the way down to M. We're in Istanbul. <laughs> Not really though, but at least in the airport. Does it count? <laughs> this looks like a movie right now. Really? Your hair flowing about. <laughs> Every language in the world. One day. We're just at checking, getting everything sorted. 
um, I think it's going smoothly. I don't know. Sure. Hopefully. <laughs> hi, hi, how are you? Guys, that has been the friendliest check-in desk I've ever come across. Literally. Like, they were so nice, so helpful. I asked them to give me my little luggage back and she's going to give it back to me. Like, oh, they're amazing. They were literally like the friendliest people ever, like Kaudi said. And I didn't expect that. When they were asking for all the documents, I was getting anxious because yes. like, what if one thing on that document was wrong? But luckily, everything on that document was right. They were very helpful. The guy was like, are you guys YouTubers? Because he saw the camera. Yes. And he's like, how many followers do you have? I think he was trying to like see if you're certified or not. But <laughs> yeah, like they're super helpful. It's 12.54 and boarding starts in 30 minutes. Oh, so really? Yes. Oh, mad. We need to go. <laughs> All right, let's go. We've just passed security, passport controls, everything. Now it's time to find our gate. Our, they say we need to go into a little bus. I'm not sure exactly, but it's time to figure out how to get to our airplane. Guys, they have such a luxurious airport. Well, I'm seeing Saint Laurent, Bottega, Hermes, Louis Vuitton, Gucci, Fendi. Oh my goodness. Hey, God, you want to spend some Rex? No. You want to spend I, some Rex? I'm happy <laughs> just going and wearing the same things I've been wearing for the past 10 years. For people that haven't been on the aeroplane or been to an airport in a long time, airports are still super busy. Like I didn't expect it to be this busy, but it is. And everything's open, everything's operating as normal. As you can see, it's crazy out here. We're currently at the boarding area and we're just waiting. I'm not sure when they will start boarding because it said at 2.25 and it's like 2.30 something now. Yeah, probably in the next five minutes. They're just getting ready. Yeah, yeah, they're just doing their thing. I'm really excited to fly with them though because a lot of the research I've made ends up telling me that Singapore Airlines is one of the best mm -hmm. airlines to fly with. Yeah, so I'm super excited. I'm super excited. I think they've got those little COVID packages as well, the mask and sanitizer wipes and stuff like that, like the one yeah. we went up Air Albania. In Air Albania, the flight was so quick that I didn't really need a change of mask or anything, no. but here I'm probably going to need it because it's 10 hours and 20 10 minutes. Hours. That's crazy. That is Longest crazy. flight ever. Don't mind if I do. Face mask, hand sanitizer, and a surface wipe. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Take care. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank Have you. a lovely day. Have a lovely day. Bye, guys. Is my okay? uh, it's so kind. Thank you. Thank you. How are you? Welcome Hello. and go. Thank you so much. Guys, we're here. That's crazy. Ooh, look at these ones. <laughs> Maybe we need to fly with them over here one day. Yo, these are them premium seats. Wow. This is us? No, this is uh, business. premium. Oh, business. Oh, 44. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, wow. wow. This is such an incredible, Whoa. like, Singa everything. Singapore Airlines have got 1010 from me, 1010 rating for me already. And, and we're we, not even in the air yet. <laughs> literally, we got greeted as soon as we came onto the flight, but like, really in a very nice way. We came through the cabin, we sat down, they gave us these little blankets pillows wow is it comfortable Very. also if your pillow isn't enough for you 
you know, you got that extra comfort. <laughs> Guys, I've never been on a long flight before. This might be normal to some of you, but this is very new to me. So I'm going to take on a little cabin tour as well, show you what I've got in front of me. Oh, thank, thank you so you. much. What's we got headphones. Oh, no way. It's what I mean. They're just so amazing. They're like, just giving us everything. As soon as we sat down, the host came over, greeted us, made us aware of the fact that there's only 25, 29 people on board. That's cool. Yeah, that's cool. And, and like it was just very like nice. He told us like all the services they have. He told us that because there's only 25 people, 28 people, we can walk down the rest of the plane, like stretch our legs. They're seating with more legroom as well. We can move to there. It was very nice about it. It's been crazy already. And there's Wi-Fi on board. Wi-Fi. We've got a little Game Boy thing here. You just press the button, it pops out, extends as well. It looks like a little Game Boy, like a PSP controller. That's so cool. Games, listen, watch. Oh my goodness. They got a lot of movie selections. No way. Oh, Wally baby. Have you seen this? No. This is a It's touch screen. It's touch screen. No way. I'm gonna be quiet. It's probably guys, it's touch screen. No. That's incredible. Then gentlemen, for No, you know you don't need to do that. You just go like and it pulls back. <laughs> incredible. Two USB ports as well, charge your phone. If you wanna hang up your jumper out or your coat, put it right there. See, it's the headphones she gave us, they go in here. Yes, and then you got a table tray as well. Oh, what's this? <gasps> no. Oh my god. Hi. Safety briefing. Also, if you want to go back a bit. <gasps> oh my god, this is so. Guys, it moves the under chair as well. This is like the most comfortable economy chair I've ever been in. I just wanted to show you the toilet in the economy cabin. And it pretty much looks the same as every other economy toilet. It's got all the essentials, it's tiny. Got some tissue, got some more tissue. And so, and also you have a moisturizing hand cream. Got like a little amenity section. When you click it, it's got toothbrush. It's actually got little pads for if you're in your period. Now, I'm not 100% what that is. I've got a razor over there. I don't know if you guys can see. I'm not trying to like, Take it right now. Then you got another mirror. Alright guys, so it's time to use the goodies they gave us. Ooh. You got medical mask. Ooh, you got a little disinfectant surface wipe and hand sanitizer. I'm gonna use a disinfectant hand and surface wipe now. I feel like this might be a little bit dirty. You can just clean this up a little bit. Enjoying your food? I'm just nervous and anxious for some reason, so I'm just eating. about the Wi-Fi but I just found out that the Wi-Fi is only for like texting whatsapp and stuff like that so you can't go on Instagram and you can't do any of that but it's teasing me because I'm getting the notifications from Instagram TikTok and everything but I can't go on it guys the Kevin crew member that's managing this area is so kind like he's come over to us he see that we finished our meals and he said would you like to try the other main course this is the fish main course so he's allowed us to try this as well and I'm just grateful to be on this side he wants to say damn these guys eat fast daddy kings <laughs> 
but you know we're gonna get tucked straight into this meal. Howdy, come show them what we got here. You got some roasted vegetables, mashed potato, and fish with sauce. experiencing it like that and I love it. Singapore Airlines playing cards. These are so cool. I can't wait to beat you. Good morning guys. I literally just had like the most amazing nap. It's currently 3.55 a.m. in Singapore. Um, that's the local time in Singapore right now so we're having breakfast on the flight. I decided to get chicken noodles with some tea and we got a little bread and a little sauce as well with the orange juice. Mm, that's a nice little, that's like bread. <laughs> I think I'm the only one that has noodles for breakfast but this is amazing. I'm enjoying it so much. Kaudi, how are you enjoying your eggs? I think I still have some snacks in my body, so I'm not starving, but it definitely feels the taste really good. We've got like one hour and 40 minutes until we reach Singapore, so I'm really excited. Gaudi's really excited. We had a nice little nap, so we're probably going to stay awake for like the remaining time. Um, I'm watching a movie, I'm watching Captain Marvel, you guys can see. Singapore Airlines so far? 10, 10. I just want to say a big thank you to Singapore Airlines, a big thank you to Sivakuma and his cabin crew team. Like, they've been amazing. This isn't a promotion at all. It's just our honest opinion, our honest review. And we really appreciate hospitality. It's not every day you fly in economy and get treated like you're in first class. So like, this is a really, really amazing experience. For breakfast, I had chicken noodles. So I need to freshen up my breath because it did have very strong sauce. So we want to go to Amenity right here and get a toothbrush. So a toothbrush there. From Singapore Airlines. Comes with a nice toothbrush as well. Guys, I have never brushed my teeth on an aeroplane before. <laughs> my breath is smelling clean. We've got 44 minutes until we land. Guys, we made it to Singapore Airport. Ooh. This is crazy. Singapore Airlines has to be, hands down, one of the best airlines in the world. It has to be. Yeah. Because the service we experienced was, it was incredible. It the was hospitality so was crazy. Mental. You know, that's how they treat everyone. Like, they, they don't know who we are or anything. They just treat everyone amazingly. Literally. I was just like, for us. <laughs> for us, really? So right now in Singapore, it's around 6 a.m. Mm. Um, I believe in Albania. It's seven hours before, so it's, uh, it's what, 11 p.m. And that means today we did all the traveling in one day because we left at like 8 a.m. So we managed to get here by 12 p.m. over there. Does that make sense? All, all these flight... No. I'm still confused, guys. <laughs> so if you're confused, don't worry. Join the club. Well, I'm trying to say, it's been a long day. Yeah. We went to Istanbul. From Istanbul, we came to Singapore. Mm -hmm. And it's been an incredible experience. Yeah. Even our little rushing to the check-in desk was amazing. But yeah, guys, we love you so much. We hope you enjoyed our journey from Tirana to Singapore. And we can't wait to show you more. We did it! We told you to put me down. I'm no. still celebrating. God is great, man. God is great, bro. And able to. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Sorry. You smell like Red Bull. What? <laughs> yeah, I got drunk Red Bull. You don't know the person. Bottles give you wings. 
Wait, what? What? Ya está conmigo un día más. Negativo? Negativo! Hey. Everything was riding on this COVID test, guys. If we got a positive COVID test, God forbid, then all our plans, all our flights would have had to be cancelled. But, oh, shit. <laughs> Carrying passengers of Starliner. Emergency exits in this aircraft. Take a few moments now to locate your nearest exit. Hello. Behind you. Count. Hello. Don't go. Don't go away. Cold piss. They came. Sorry, go. You go. Speak. They make sure to keep your mouth entertained. Whoa. What? Bro, he just rubbed the whole row. 11 p.m. Yeah, it's a, it's a, whoa, you just burped. That smells. <laughs> it was a little one. <laughs> whoa, why does it smell so much? Just because I ate the chicken noodles. <laughs> <laughs>